Mm. Hi everyone, I'm Aiko and this is Ben. Ben is one of our son's really good friends and he's an amazing cook but he would like to learn how to make refried beans from scratch and we're gonna make them with no lard and organic and really really tasty with a little secret from Diabeti. So what I did Ben, I already pre-cooked the pinto beans so they are right here and they are tender to save a little bit of the liquid. Then with all the vegetables which were the onions and the garlic. And we're gonna run that till they get really, really smooth. Take you in a blender, half a tablespoon of white vinegar, chipotles in adobo sauce for a little bit of spice. So we're adding the second half of the beans to puree them. We're adding half a teaspoon of the chipotle and adobo sauce, half a tablespoon of white vinegar, and half a teaspoon of salt. So in a cast iron skillet or an old clod at medium heat, you're going to, first it's very important that your pan is very, very hot mm -hmm. uh, before you start. So they will give it more caramelization and it's just best. So how do you know when it's hot? When you place your whole hand mm -hmm. like a couple of inches above and it's so hot that you cannot hold it for more than three seconds, it means that it's hot. So then you, you are ready to go and we do about a tablespoon of canola oil and because your pan was so hot it's mm -hmm. just going to go immediately hot okay. and we're going to add our beans that we puree in the food processor juice where the beans cooked okay. to make them more spreadable mm -hmm. and you can mix that and when they burp the first time whether you see a little bubble go mm -hmm. bloop then that, that they're ready A little bubble. Everyone's standing. I'm supposed to. I'm supposed to be in the camera view. Okay. Oh, sorry. Are we still camera? Chicken. Do you want me? Get out of here. Let's get here and Is this so good? You gotta get the crema. You guys are talking in the shot. Jesse's. Those are so amazing. Mmm. You're supposed to soak your dry pinto beans in cold water overnight. Or boil them for five minutes and then discard that water. After five minutes of boiling, drain to your beans. I added new water and at low heat, we're gonna cook these beans for about one and a half hours or close to two hours. We're gonna add half a white onion, one garlic, and one teaspoon of black pepper. No salt, okay? 